Get off the right wheel. We close off tonight's call. Normally, this is where we would end the call, but um, I actually got word from um, one of our newer representatives. Um, he actually has a testimonial to share um, with respect to our product. Um, I don't even know what the testimonial is at this time. I just know that it's something um, very compelling, and he wanted to actually share it with you guys. So um, I want to actually bring to the line um, someone that I've grown to have a lot of respect for. Um, he's out of the Atlanta, Georgia market. Um, he is um, 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 a direct recruit from Mr. Kevin Smith, um, and that is none other than Mr. Chris Lassen. Um, Mr. Lassen, if you're on the line, if you could press star six um, and share your testimonial. Okay. Well, I thank you, Mrs. Suber, uh, for allowing me to have the opportunity to share my testimony. I also thank Kevin uh, for the continued support. Uh, I just want to share with you guys, um, I'm still a little new to the business, but what I can say is that uh, for the last couple of months, um, I unexpectedly uh, experienced, um, um, well, a emergency visit. Uh, to the emergency room um, at a nearby hospital here on behalf of my daughter. Uh, actually, um, she was diagnosed uh, with encephalitis uh, and the last two months have been uh, quite a challenge. Um, and with encephalitis, if you're not familiar with it, it's a very rare autoimmune virus and it attacks your antibodies, uh, your blood cells, it generally shuts down your body. Uh, it causes high levels of anxiety. It causes stiffness in your body and in your neck. And it also uh, makes you immobile. Uh, and it uh, prevents you from being able to actually talk. And so uh, for the last couple of months, we've been uh, on undergoing numerous uh, studies and blood tests for my daughter. And um, incidentally, uh, had a hospital stay of about 10 days where she underwent uh, blood tests, MRIs, bone marrow process uh, procedures, um, CAT scans, you name it. And in the end, um, after the blood transfusions, we realized that she was, would be dependent upon steroids uh, to kind of get back to herself, so to say, uh, to get those blood levels and things of that nature up. Um, after the 10-day stay at the hospital, we were released uh, and given a small dosage of steroids that we would have to taper off. Uh, after about two weeks of using the steroids and her being able to, to gain some type of independence, we noticed that uh, the inflammation uh, came back. During the entire two-month period, there was inflammation on her brain. We, we underwent EEG tests, just a number of tests, and none of the neurologists or pediatricians could really figure out what was going on. But the inflammation remained in her body and remained um, in her brain. And so, um, again, after being released and given the steroids, my wife and I we knew that we couldn't continue using the steroids because they damaged your, the inner lining of your body, of your stomach. And after um, discontinuing the steroids, the symptoms came back, the inflammation, the fatigue, the anxiety, her inability to feed herself, uh, clothe herself, things of that nature. Uh, so it's a, it a very uh, traumatic experience not only for her, but for us, because it also created insomnia. In the end, I share this story simply because we were faced with two options, either go back to the emergency room where she would have to undergo all of those procedures again just to get the treatment and medication, or uh, to simply take an alternative route. That alternative route for us was using the oxygen CBD. And we begin to use 1,000 milligrams of the oxygen CBD on a daily basis. And we've recorded her progression through the entire process. And what I can share with you today is that there is no inflammation in her body or in her brain. 
and she has undergone uh, additional blood tests here in the last couple of weeks, and all of the results have come back where she does not have encephalitis in her body, and she's able to talk again, able to clothe herself again, able to eat again, all of those things that she could not do. Again, keeping in mind that we were basically kind of faced with either going back to the hospital and having to take all of those pharmaceuticals that we know were poisoning her body or take an alternative route, and we decided in this case uh, to use the oxygen CBD, and it has worked for her, and she's thriving and strong today. And so um, I share this story uh, as a personal testimony because we've had to go undergo this for the last couple of months, but also to let you know that there are other young people and little children out there and, and elderly people uh, or children with disabilities that could benefit from what we're offering, and there are a ton of people that are not aware uh, of this alternative. And so um, I would encourage you to speak with the pediatricians that may be in your area or speak with the neurologist. And um, my child's neurologist uh, evaluated her on a Monday where uh, she was at a weakened state by Thursday. She was a completely different person. And he couldn't believe it until I shared it with him that I have a CBD business, an online business, and he wanted to know more about it. And so he and I are now in talks about having um, my brochures and having uh, the oxygen brand uh, placed there uh, in, his op in his office. And so it's something that he's looking to invest in, and so we're going to continue those talks that could potentially help other uh, families. And just keeping in mind, you know, just, just imagine for a moment you not being able to feed yourself or clothe yourself or even being able to talk, right? Think about that for a moment and how it would affect you, but now think about how it would affect those who will be caring for you, right? And so um, if you're able to provide, you know, someone with an alternative, um, you know, that can help them get back to being themselves and having independence, um, you know, I would encourage you uh, to look at um, – the medical field in a different way. Uh, those pediatricians are interested in learning about it, and uh, as well from what I've discovered, neurologists as well. And so, um, I encourage you to to uh, start some of those conversations. So, that's my testimony that I wanted to share with you. And since uh, that time, um, I've also been able to help a restaurant owner who has cancer, and since she's been using the oxygen brand, she says she has not had a need to go back to, um, you know, any of the, the necessary uh, treatments that she generally undergoes with chemotherapy and things of that nature. So uh, she personally came up to me and thanked me. And, um, you know, I think there's opportunities out there for us to help other people as well. So um, I know it's, it's about starting a business and, and, and getting you the financial freedom, but also um, if you're ever looking for another why, uh, this could potentially be it. So thank you for uh, for giving me this time and this platform. Man, man, I'm speechless. I think I'm speaking on behalf of uh, everybody on the call. I was texting Kevin as you were talking, Chris. And, um, man, first off, let me ask you a quick question, Chris, if you don't mind. Um, sure. How old is your daughter? She's actually 15 years of age. Wow. Yeah. Wow. So, that's That's yeah. – absolutely amazing. Um, one of the things that um, I think you should definitely do, and, um, you know, of course, it's your choice because it's your family, but um, if you're open to it, um, consider creating um, a video, um, a video testimonial, um, and kind of walking through your experiences because, of course, that would be great for your business, but even business aside, just like you said, it can make such a huge difference in other people's lives to just know that there's an alternative that people can try, you know, and, and thank God you, you had the wherewithal to try it within a window um, that it could help and you could impact so many more people with that. But man, that was such a powerful testimony. You shared it beautifully, man. And I'm just really happy that, um, you know, things have turned out for the better. I appreciate it. I appreciate the, the, the support, the continued support. And then again, you know, I thank, um, you know, Kevin again for even introducing me to, you know, Five Links and Oxygen Brand because 
had he not introduced me to it, you know, we would have been uh, at a loss, you know, um, you know, in so many different ways. Um, but again, when your back is against the wall and you don't know quite which way to go and you're uh, heavily dependent on the advice of doctors and they're saying, well, our offices are not open, but we can't get you in and for another month, um, to be able to have this as an alternative um, was was uh, was super. It's, it's it's changed our lives and made all of the difference. And so, for me, any investment that I've ever made in in these products, you know, it's come full circle for me. Wow. Oh, all right, I'm trying to <laughs> keep it together, man. I appreciate that testimonial. That's that's why we do this, man. We we do it for that reason, man. And it's, man, that that really. Yeah. All right, my man. <laughs> if anybody else has anything to say before we go ahead and close off the call, please press star six. I'd like to um, say something. And share your thoughts. Yes, yeah, This go ahead. is Debbie. This is Debbie. And, Chris, I want to say to you that that was very – I'm speechless as well. <laughs> that was very powerful. And thank you so much for feeling comfortable and sharing your story. I think it's – I mean, I think it's an eye-opener for all of us. Yep. And so I'm going through my own crisis, so I really appreciate your testimony today. You don't know how much. Yeah, well, I so appreciate thank it. Thank you so much. Thank you. I, that, that's that's my hope is to, um, you know, help more people. The more people that we can, you know, help and lives that we can save, uh, the better. So, you know, my, my approach is a little different, um, and it's more personal in that way, but as I was visiting those doctors' offices and neurologists, there were other children that were in there with the same conditions, and their parents had no idea. And so just imagine if your information is placed in a doctor's office or a neurologist's office or a pediatrician's office, and you've developed that relationship and that trust, how it can affect others, you know, in that way. So, yeah. uh, This is Kevin. Um, Chris, I want to say thank you so much. I know we talked, but we didn't talk in depth. You didn't tell me all that, and um, I just want to say I appreciate it. And I'm going back to think when I was 15 years old, you know, about to get my driver's license and everything and happy and riding a bike and playing and just Matthew, your daughter, couldn't do any of that. And, you know, just, just really touched me, and I have a nephew and niece that I really care about down in Atlanta area that I go see on a regular basis, and just to have – to think about they couldn't do that, it would just, like, tear me up. So I just want to thank you so much for sharing that. I'm glad she is doing so much better. I'm glad the product is helping her and continue to pray for your family to get better and better. Hey, I appreciate it, and, and, and we're using it every week. Awesome. Thank you. Hi, this All right, is great. Linda. Who else do we have? Hey, Linda, um, I just wanted away. to say... What a great testimony, and this is exactly why I said at the beginning that, you know, it's going to become more than just going after the money because there's people out there that need us, and if you really get out there and, you know, uh, put the product in people's hands and let them try and sample uh, sample it, and what better way that to share a story such as, you know, that's as powerful as this, because we never know who needs us and who's waiting on us. You know, somebody needs to be healed through us. Somebody needs to be relieved from pain, you know, through us. And so we can't just sit back and be afraid to say anything because we don't know who needs us. So, you know, um, I'm grateful that you shared that testimony, and we'll definitely be sharing your story. And like, you know, um, Mr. Super said, if you can um, – you know, do a little short video, even if it's just for us, because we would love to be able to share that with people and uh, and especially with the doctors and physicians to help um, grow this business because, you know, Absolutely. they say make make America healthy, uh, uh, great again, but we say make America great again through good health. That is the truth. And I definitely will be working on that for you guys. Okay. Thank you. Hey, Chris. This is Lashana. Hi. Hi. So very, extremely powerful um, testimony. Um, I was really starting to hear about your daughter. We were actually at Nationals 
Um, Kevin flew in for the one day, and we were walking down the hall, and he said, you know, he said, Chris's daughter, he said, she's not feeling well. She's, you know, she's got encephalitis. Her brain was swollen. She's taking CBD, and her shrinking went down the, the brain. And I said, what? I literally, like, stopped and made, you know, stride. Like, what are you saying? You know, he said, you know, she's got some kind of disorder, and her brain was swollen. He started giving her the CBD. I think it's 1,000 milligrams, and her, her swelling went down. And I said, oh, my God, I immediately got chills. And I said, you know, we have to hear, we have to share, he has to share this. Uh, we have to know, let people know how important this product is. And, you know, and I stay it on a weekly basis when we do calls and um, events and things like that. Um, I don't have a lot of chronic problems. So I'm taking CBD as a supplement. But every time I share that product with someone who really needs it and I get those testimonies back, I mean, it's life-altering. I can't believe it. I have to share it with as many people as possible. I get super excited because, you know, the impact it's making in people's lives and health is better than wealth any day, especially for a family or for a father. So I appreciate your bravery and I appreciate your patience and your willingness to try the product um, for your daughter. And um, I pray for you then. I'll continue to pray for you now, you and your family. And I'm just um, what a blessing. I think that's beautiful. And thank you so much for sharing that with us. Thank you. Thank you. No, I appreciate it. All right, guys. I think we might have time for one more. Somebody else has a question or comment? All right. Going once, going twice. All right. Well, um, Chris, again, thank you so much for sharing that. Um, I will be sharing the call recording um, in the group me, um, but if you want to access it right away or give it away right away, um, it's, it's, everything's the same. Instead of 4160, it's 4169. But I'm going to go ahead and put that in the group me, and you could share this call. But thank you, Chris, once again for blessing us with that. And thank you, um, Ms. Ransom, for sharing that phenomenal training. I mean, this, this call was a good one-two punch and really appreciate um, not only you two, but every one, single one of you guys, because without every single one of you, we aren't a team. And uh, that being said, this call is now officially over. Take care and good night.